All right, I've finished putting doors and windows throughout the entire house. Also notice off of this room I have a sliding glass door shown. I also have a sliding glass door shown over here. What I want to do next is hatch the wall so that way it's a little bit more visible. Let me show you what I mean. First of all, I want to create a new layer. So go to the Layer Manager. Create a new layer. And I'll call this layer A-Wall Hatch. I'm going to change the color. I want it to be a gray color. So usually the uh, gray scale about 253 or 252 are good for this type of hatching. I'll say OK. And I want to set this layer as being the current layer. And then close Layer Manager. Now, I want to use the Hatch command. So, I can go over here, click the Hatch button, and it says to s pick internal points or settings. Let me type in a T. I type in T because T is uppercased here, and T will take me to a dialog box. This is a little bit easier to explain what's going to happen. Hatch has many settings here, so looking at how this is um, laid out, you can try some things. We simply want a solid hatch pattern. If it's not showing, you can select solid here in uh, this list of um, hatches. You can also go to the three dot button and see some examples of what hatches look like. I'll cancel. We're going to select a solid. I have a couple of options for selecting an area. It has to be a, an enclosed area, so I'm going to pick points. So Let me choose this option, and I will select the wall between here, and you can see that it already hatches. Select that one, that one. So I'm just going to go around and do all the exterior walls. of where I'm selecting and close. There we go. All right, I think I have them all, so I'll press enter and the command is complete. You can see how much clearer I can see the um, walls and the windows. I'll do the same with the interior walls. Go to the hatch and notice that I can go straight to picking internal points. So I'll do the interior walls next. I really have to be careful here. Make sure I click inside the interior walls. Press enter to end the command. Remember, if you make a mistake, you can always go back and undo a command, and you can step back as many commands as you need to.